guys, welcome to part one. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the Nintendo, which is the GameCube leader on your Wii Wii U. I'm using a Wii running 4.1 U, and you need the homebrew channel installed. I don't even have it on my Wii U, but I have it on my Wii, so I'll have the link in the description box of what you have to download. You have to download the Nintendo Forwarder. That's the watch so you can quickly access it from the Wii menu. And this is where you get the GameCube ISOs, which will be a similar to expect that you have to, if you're a Windows user, you will have to download Simsip or WinRAR. If you are a Mac user, you have to download your archiver from the App Store, which is free. Just click View, hit Launch, and it'll automatically open. Just hit it, install the app, and you'll need to enter your Apple ID and password. I have already installed it onto my computer, and you'll also have to download the mod pack as the wad, the wad manager. It'll be rare. Again, you'll be needing the archiver, 7-zip, or WinRAR to extract that. After you have all the files downloaded, you want to go into your SD. You, if you're using a flash drive, you only need both an SD card and a USB flash drive. So you want to create a new footer called WAD and you want to put in the Nintendo Forwarder WAD. And you want to go ahead and after you have that WAD in there, it, you want to install the games. Now you want to create a new footer called games. You have to make sure you spell the name of the games correctly. If you spell it wrong, then it then if you spell it wrong, then it will be not able to recognize your game. So I got two games: Paper Mario and Super Smash Bros. So you just put the name of your game, then rename your ISO to Game Dot ISO and drag and drop. It'll take a while because it's one gigabyte. So after that. This works on 4.1, 4.2, 4.3, and this even also works on a, a Wii U running 5.0.0, 5.0.1, Okay, so I'll see you in the next part.